Okay, eat, move, rest, fam. Today we are talking about genetics. So, oh, and Bo's gonna come say hi to me probably the whole time I talk. You know that Aaron and I have been kind of obsessed with getting our blood work done lately. We've actually even had Max's blood work done in his first year. Everybody in general, we should all be getting our blood work tested and keeping tabs on where we are at nutritionally. That being said, I kind of was wanting more information, wanting to take the next step into untapping my story. I went ahead and worked with Dante Labs to get my genetic testing completed. So this is game changing. This is technology, science, and medicine at its like highest level. And I think it's super exciting. Again, some people, AKA Aaron, she's like secretly afraid to do her uh, genetics test, which by the way, I think she should. And you guys should comment below and encourage her to do hers. But yeah, some people are afraid of it because they don't want to know what's wrong with them. But again, you know, I, I prefer knowing. So I think genetic testing is so super important so you do know. Also, what I think is really cool is that this will last me a lifetime. You know, I can go in, whether it's in 10 or 20 or 50 years, say that something does happen or I would have some kind of illness or disease that, that I need help with or treatment for, they can pull up now this my whole DNA sequence and they can say, well, this is this, this is this, and they can literally break down my DNA. And hopefully, you know, again, as things progress and I can only imagine what it's gonna be like in 50 years in terms of medicine, DNA, and the things that they can change and fix, etc. So I think it's super important. That's why I did it. I think it's uh, really important for everyone. Again, which is why I think we should encourage Aaron to do it. <laughs> I think that it's something again that Dante Labs is doing very well, and they're actually making pretty affordable. Besides disease prevention. The ones that I'm most excited about from Dante Labs are the health and wellness reports, the fitness reports, and the nutrigenomics. They also have a pharmacogenomics report, which basically says which medications work for you and maybe don't work as well for you. Unfortunately, due to FDA regulations, this is not available for us in the US. I think that it may be available in the future, but beyond that, if you are in Europe or if you're in any other country besides the US who has these crazy FDA restrictions, you can get all of these reports from Dante Labs. And again, go to the website, check them out for yourself. But the ones that I specifically have loved and, and dug into are again, health, wellness, fitness, and nutrition. These, these tests that they sent me are telling me what exercises are better for me. Another one said that I should do isometric exercises. So anyway, that's something that like is crazy specific and like really exciting for me. So again, love their love all their tests love all their results i gotta be honest i've still got a bunch of digging to do first i look to make sure i didn't have any disease check i'm like pretty pretty good there there are some red flags on a few things but again nothing serious and nothing that can't be changed through diet and lifestyle and now i'm just having fun again like digging into the research and reading the results and the recommendations and the warnings that they have for again specific foods specific diets in general specific uh fitness routines now i like the results i like that i have a platform online i can log in i can find it all there they make it fun they make it creative they make it colorful and they make it super easy highly recommend dante labs we want to offer you guys 15 percent off your genetic testing if you decide this is something you want to do again go to dantelabs.com i'm going to link in the description below the test that we recommend that you guys do enter the code eat move rest to get your 15 percent off and do what i did i'm going to demonstrate the testing actually now good morning you guys so apparently this is the month for blood tests blood draws finger pricks everything we just put out a video for our vegan blood work that Aaron and I had a lot of fun filming and got a lot of good information back on. Now we're doing something that I'm super excited about, genetic testing. So you open the pack, it says let's get started. First you have to go um, to the website and like register, sign up, and kind of create your, your 
platform, if you will, and then you remove the test. This is the saliva test, which I'm thrilled about. I'm not a blood guy, and I'll spit in the cup like any day. So super simple, six, five steps here actually. Spit in this, it comes with a prepaid shipping label, send it back, and then you get your results. Here we go, let's do it. Don't drink, smoke, brush your teeth, or chew gum for 30 minutes. And your last cigarette was how long ago? I haven't smoked for like, 30 minutes, uh, 32 minutes, so we're good. Okay, so remove the cap, funnel in, and spit to the fill line. And it says bubbles don't count. Okay, this might take a little while. Aaron said, if you need to salivate, why don't you come have a bite of these lactation brownies? Which, by the way, they... They're amazing. They're fun for the whole family, not <laughs> just for lactating mothers. Yes. If you guys want that recipe, comment below. And now that my spit has filled this up, shake it up, repack it, and send it back. So put it back in the plastic. You, like I said, you can get rid of the funnel part, put it in the box. It comes with a US prepaid shipping label, goes back to Italy. I'll be back on this video as soon as we get the results. I love Dante Labs. Again, not just because they're in Italy and we love all things Italy, but number one, their website is phenomenal. It took like two, maybe three weeks to get my results back. And again, after creating my platform, I just got a simple email that said your results are ready. Click the link and we have pages and pages of information on my genetic makeup. Genetic testing, I think is super important because it can point out any changes or mutations in your genes that may cause disease or illness. And DNA testing can actually help with diagnosing, treating, and or preventing these illnesses, right? It's all about those three things. How do you diagnose, how do you prevent, or how do you treat it, right? So anyway, if you have a predisposition to a certain illness or a certain disease, wouldn't you actually like to know about it so you can properly diagnose, properly treat, and or possibly avoid it, like in, in general? So again, we do that through what we're, what we're now talking about and what I talked a little bit about already, which is epigenetics, being able to change the expression of these genes for your benefit. Aaron and I go to conferences all over the nation. In fact, we just had our last plant-based food conference in Omaha, Nebraska, which is where we're from, right here in the Midwest. And there were over 2,000 people, some of the most influential doctors, especially leading the field in plant-based nutrition. We had some friends there. We had some friends that spoke and it was just awesome. It was a great time. And one of the things that I kept hearing these doctors talk about was epigenetics. Epigenetics relating to or arising from non-genetic influences on gene exp expression. Okay, so again, the non-genetic part means lifestyle. The idea that our genetics only make up like 11% of our health outcomes, okay? So some people might think, oh man, that's scary. You know, 11% and that number changes a little bit. I've heard some people say it's up to 15%. I've heard other people say it's only 8%. So we'll just fall somewhere in the middle. I think the number I see mostly is 11%. That leaves 89 or 90% roughly up to us, right? That, that means that 90% of our health outcomes are within our own reach. So what does that mean for us? Lifestyle, lifestyle, li li lifestyle. How can we change our lifestyle or what are some lifestyle modifications that can be made to make sure that we are living longer, living healthier lives? Well, the three things that we all do every day that we could all be doing much better. I'm sure you guys have heard that, right? Eat, move, rest. This is the name of our channel. This is what Aaron and I recognized years ago when our own health had gone south, when we weren't feeling as well as we had hoped in our 20s. Now in our 30s, we have found that the secret is doing these three things better. Eating, moving, and resting at your best for success, for a long, healthy life. These are the things that we can do, and that's what we wanna focus on. So, eat. Why eat first? We eat three times a day, at least. I eat like 20 times a day. It seems like I'm always eating. 
Erin and I have slowly worked ourselves into a whole food, plant-based diet, a vegan diet now for probably close to seven years. I have seen my skin look better, my muscles be stronger, my sleep be deeper. Everything in my life has pretty much gotten better living this healthier lifestyle. That being said, I am not immune to stress. I do catch a cold. I have had struggles with sleep, all of these things because I'm human. But I like my odds best, not just for the way I look and feel, but how I am on the inside. My blood work has been better than ever since being on a plant-based, whole food, plant-based, vegan lifestyle. So that's why we recommend it to you guys. Number two, move. This is something that Aaron and I also do every single day. It is, I think, 15 degrees out right now and super windy, which is why I'm inside in the warmth, taking as much time as I can away from my work to record this video because it is cold outside. I am not gonna go for a run today. I'm not gonna do anything outside if I don't have to. So what do I do to move? Well, we have a handful of workout videos that Aaron has filmed. I've got an indoor workout video that I have filmed. We go to the gym, we do whatever we can to move our bodies. Aaron even says that vacuuming is a workout for her some days. And me too, I love to vacuum, I love to clean. Anything that makes you move, my mom actually is in a dance club right now. She's taking lessons and she has these dance parties every Thursday night. And it's like, what gets you excited? What makes you want to move? And how does that moving make you feel? You can do this in a number of ways. I'm not judging. I just want to see all of us moving, not just for fun, but for health, right? So the more you move, the younger you'll feel, the more loose you get, stretch out, do some yoga. I mean, all of these things are going to make us look and feel stronger, younger, better. We're going to live longer. Number three, rest. Why rest? Well, aren't we supposed to sleep when we're dead? Like, isn't this the hustle hard like lifestyle that the Gary V's of the world are telling us? Like, don't ever stop. Work, 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 work and play obviously work and play but don't ever sleep i have found this year since max is born number one we have a one-year-old that sleeps in bed with us so my sleep has struggled a little bit i tend to get in my head i tend to get a little stressed out so that has affected my sleep this year i went through a really hard time this summer with a few bouts of insomnia that were really scary and I recognized in those days where I wasn't sleeping the night before how out of whack I was. My hormones were out of whack. My mood was out of whack. I was having panic attacks. Like it was terrible. And it was all because I wasn't sleeping well or at all in some cases. So we really need to reprioritize sleep. This is probably one of the most important ones. Again, it's almost easy to find healthy options now when it comes to food, which is great. You go to Whole Foods or your local health food market and you can find a myriad of health foods that you couldn't find even five years ago. Trust me, Aaron and I know it was not easy as it is now to be vegan a few years ago. And it's also easy to move. I mean, it's cool to work out now. There's a number of gyms that Aaron likes to go to in town because they all offer something different. You, there's trackables that you can wear and moving is fun. But when it comes to sleep, where's the fun? You know what I mean? It's not like we talk about sleep. We don't practice sleep or rest. You know, how about yoga, meditation, prayer, worship, you know, spirituality, all of these things aren't as cool as you know going to a vegan restaurant and working out at the gym with with your your crew you know what i mean rest is like the unappreciated one that unfortunately gets overlooked sometimes but it is so so important rest is when we our bodies refuel recharge re-energize most importantly it's when they heal so if you are constantly going, 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 fueling your body, working your body out, but you're not taking the time to heal and recover, not just your body, but your mind, you are on a, you're on the wrong course. Trust me, I've been there and I still can get there sometimes. So 
try to prioritize sleep. Aaron and I are wanting to do more rest videos, whether that be guided meditations or talks about our spirituality and our faith and how we calm down, cool down, chill out and relax as a family. And we need to do that soon. If you guys have any tips or advice or videos that you would like us to do in regards to our rest category, please comment and leave them in the comments below. We really need to get on that again because it's just as overlooked in our family too. Okay guys, I am actually gonna go in and show you a little bit more. So sorry if the audio is a little bit wonky. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna click Nutrigenomics here and show you, okay, it says 23 health conditions analyzed. You can look here quick and see body weight, eating habits, macronutrients, micronutrients, taste and reactions. So you can actually click each one of these. Uh, it's nice that it shows you right here that I'm low risk in all of these categories, but then you can click and open each one up. This is a fitness report. And again, obviously being someone who likes to work out, I'm super interested in this. And it just says a quick summary over here. And then it's got main main message endurance workout strength workout muscle pulse at rest and it really just says people with your genetic profile are predis predisposed to this get more benefits from this and again i just think it's super interesting it goes on and on and on and on okay so this is the cool part this is what i was talking about earlier strength workout so again this breaks down all of the categories before but it goes down into detail so a strength workout can be described as blank and then it tells me my my situation here um it says that people in my genome type are predisposed to being overweight which i can see if you look at at least all the the older men in my family they all have these big bellies that being said like we said before if 11 percent of your genetics make up your outcome it just goes to show that me eating the way that I eat and doing the things that I do is, is going to help me stay lean. So magnesium, this is super interesting. People with your genetic profile are more likely to have lower magnesium levels. Okay, I will just say that the one thing that has benefited my sleep the most is magnesium. So just saying, lower vitamin D metabolism. Um, let's see, having a lower vitamin D metabolism means that you should consume the molecule more slowly. Interesting, it can be absorbed through exposure to sunlight. However, individuals weight, geographic location, and skin color can inf influence the way vitamin D is activated by ultraviolet light. So again, this is really interesting. I could do more research on that. Something else that I found really um, kind of exciting, let me go. Okay, I'm gonna scroll down here and go to genetic counseling. So you can pay, it looks like 150 bucks. After reviewing your results, our worldwide network of clinical genetic experts will help you navigate through your reports. So you get a 45 minute video call and 15 minutes are dedicated to specific questions. So this would be something, again, that's super exciting, super helpful if you have those questions like I do about vitamin D and what to do. It'd be great to be able to have a video chat or a call with one of these physicians. So again, highly recommend, guys, if you wanna see more of my results, um, comment below and let me know if you want me to do um, go into more detail on my personal results. So if you guys want more um, this type of talk, like genetics and blood work and things like that, let us know in the comments below. I know Aaron has a lot to say about this stuff too. We would love to make another video. Give this video a thumbs up, comment below, leave us some love, share this video with any of your friends, family, that actually really helps our channel grow. Follow Aaron and I on all forms of social media, especially on Instagram, at Aaron Stanzik, at DB Stanzik. You keep up with us on the day-to-day -day there, sometimes the hour-to-hour -hour with stories. You can follow us along and follow little Maxi. Anyway, thanks for watching. Eat, move, rest, your best, and peace.
We're Dusty, Aaron, Max, and Bo, and we're the Stanzix. We aspire to live a plant-centric, faith-forward, healthy lifestyle and welcome all of the adventures that accompany it. Join us every week as we blend, chop, juice, run, lift, ride, and master our minds in between on the ultimate quest to find better balance, deeper connection, and true happiness within.